Welcome to Emilia Online tutorial. I'm before us is this question in radioactivity in physics that says uh, that the half life of a radioactive substance is 14 days if 48 grams of this substance is stored after how many days will 1.5 gram of the original substance remain actually i have solved this for the we are using the first method in my previous video and if you want to do that i want to watch that you can check out my, uh, my previous video so in this video i will be using the formula method all right by using the formula method we know that the half life i mean uh, the app yeah the half life is what 14 days which is what 14 now the initial the initial mass is what 48 gram now and the the mass of the substance remaining after a particular time is 1.5 gram now and the time is what we don't know okay all right then let us recall that uh, Okay, now this is the formula where n naught is the initial mass. Now where n is actually the the number of uh, atom remaining after a after a particular time, and t is the time taken. All right, now so let us input this parameter into this equation. So here we can say this is uh, one point five equals 48 all right okay so in this case i say this is 1.5 over 48 which means we are dividing by 48 this we cancel out this so we are left with what right so 1.5 divided by 78 uh, using the calculator should give us a uh, 0 0.03125 okay all right now with this case now let us equate both sides by finding the natural log uh, logarithm of both sides so we can see here natural logarithm of 0 0.03125 uh, now equals Okay, so since this and this are the same thing, recording the using the, the log reading. So here we have now finding these now using uh, our calculator, then we should have a uh, okay. Let me just put it this way first two five, then equals now this and this. Okay, that's let me simplify it so that you get to understand what i'm doing and we know in log reading log 10 to 10 equals to 1 it could also be x to x all right so and as such now we finally have the natural log reading of 0 8 I mean 0 0.03125 and equals to all right this all right so let's move further now let us recall that the decay constant equals to 0 0.693 over the half-life all right so in this case now let us now put this into this equation so here we have 0. 0, 0.03125 equals minus 0.693 then t over now our half-life is giving us a 14 so from here now we get to calculate the value of uh, the natural log of this value now divide this by this so we get that the natural log of this we give us a uh, on my calculator we have what minus uh, 3.4657 then equals 
Now, dividing this by this using our calculator, we get a zero minus, okay, sorry, it's meant to have minus sign here, okay, you have 0 0.0495 nt. All right, with this, now divide both sides by the coefficient of t here, minus 0 0.0495, then here, minus 0 0.0495. So at the end of the day, our t, if we have to evaluate this using calculator, our t will give us approximately 70 days. All right. Thank you. And this is the solution to the question. So that's what I'll do. So please kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and ensure you click on the, the notification button to be notified of all my videos in physics, chemistry, and mathematics. Thank you and God bless you.